good morning students once again i, I continue with uh, breakaway point calculation next problem is gshs equals k over s into s plus 1 into s plus 2 into s plus 3 <coughs> now if you form the characteristic equation the highest power of s will be 4 s to the power of 4 it is a rather tedious uh, to differentiate and to solve for breakaway point so you follow this tip the tip you are supposed to follow is plot poles s equal to 0 s equal to minus 2 minus 1 s equal to minus 2 and s equal to minus 3 now first you confirm which portion of the real axis will contain root locus now between these two points definitely there will be root locus because for these points to their right, the number of poles is 1. Therefore, there will be root locus. There will be root locus here. Next, between minus 1 and minus 2, there cannot be root locus. The reason is, for these points to their right, the number of poles is even. That is 2. Therefore, no root locus. Next, between minus 2 and minus 3, definitely there is root locus. The reason is, for these points between minus 2 and minus 3 to their right the number of poles the number of poles is 3 1 2 3 therefore there will be root locus there will be root locus next to the left of minus 3 for these points to their right the number of poles is even that is 4 1 2 3 4 therefore there cannot be root locus to the left of minus 3 Therefore, therefore, between these two poles, you mark one breakaway point. The, uh, the, you follow this rule. Take exactly the middle. So, 0 minus 1 minus 0.5 is a breakaway point. Minus 0.5 is a breakaway point. Next, between minus 2 and minus 3, the middle point is minus minus 2.5. So, minus 2.5 is another breakaway point. Now, in the examination, students are not supposed to follow the procedure. dk by ds equated to 0. It, it consumes a lot of time. Therefore, follow this guideline. Guideline Roughly, if two poles are side by side, the middle point will be almost the breakaway point. So, that is a point to be followed. Now, I explain what is breakaway point. The opposite to breakaway point is what is called as break-in point. I will explain break-in point in the next class and I will take the example. Thank you.